Yeah, hi everyone. In the last session, we had discussed about find the minimum value and maximum value in the given array. In this uh, video, we'll discuss about write a program to find the first largest number and second largest number in the given array. Very, very important question they'll ask in interview point of view. So here, yeah, let us see how to do this program. Uh, let us assume I'll try to create one uh, class. The name of the class I'll give as some uh, largest demo, largest demo. Bracket open, bracket close. So here you can uh, declare one main method, public static void main. Public static void main string args, Java. Here bracket open, bracket close. And here I'll try to create one array. Let us say I'll try to create one array. Int AR is equal to new int of. The size of that I'll give as six. And here I'll try to store some values. Some three, four, one, uh, some five, seven, two, some value, one, two, three, four, six values I have given. Any value you can give your wish. Three, four, one, five, seven, six. Are you following everyone? Now, what did I want to find the first largest number in the given array? Write a program to find the first largest number in the given array. Take one variable, fl means first largest, is equal to store the first value, r of zero. And then I want to rotate the loop, how many numbers are there? Six numbers, rotate the loop six times. So here you can write, for int i is equal to zero, i less than or equal to five, zero, one, two, three, four, five. And here I'll try to go i plus plus, i plus plus. Here bracket open, bracket close. This is my for loop. And here I will try to write something like if r of i, if r of i greater than fl, fl means first largest. Is it clear? If r of i greater than fl, then here I want to swap the value. Something like here I'll try to give fl is equal to r of i. fl is equal to r of i, first largest. Yes or no? So here let us see what will happen. This is my variable name. That is FL, first largest. And here... Yes, uh, is it clear? Now if you execute this program, you will get the output, no doubt. See, first debugging is very important here. All the values are there now. This is my array, uh, val variable FL. So R of 0 is what? 3. Means 3 uh greater than three three greater than three so initially fl is three now in this line we assign the first value of the array that is three greater than three so here what will happen condition is false next value four so here four greater than three true so fl is four next one one greater than three false four false five greater than four true so fl is what? 5. 7 greater than 5. True. FL is 7. 6 greater than 7. False. So the first largest is 7. First largest is what? 7. So here I'll try to take one more variable for second. But I asked you to find the second largest. No? Save it if you want. You can uh, uh, file save as. I'll try to give the name as largest demo. Always Java program must save with class name dot Java. So file click on save as. The name will be largest demo dot Java and here open your compiler command prompt and there you can run Java C Java C space largest demo dot Java execute the program what happened here oh here you no need to create an array like this directly you can store the values so here you can see Java C space largest demo dot Java execute the program java space largest demo but i have not printed the value you know so after for loop you can print the value how to print system dot out dot println system dot out dot println of fl i want to display the first largest number in the given array now once again you compile the program every time when you modify you have to compile the program and then execute the program so answer is seven first largest number but i want to display the second largest number also so what to do here you can take one more variable int sl is equal to r of 0 
store the first value in both the variables and uh, this is my first largest number no here you can after this for loop you can write one more for loop the outer for loop here this for loop is to identify the first largest number now i'll write one more for loop for int i is equal to 0 for int i is equal to 0 i less than or equal to 5 i plus plus or else if you want you can uh, uh, confuse means here of if for int j is equal to 0 j less than or equal to 5 j plus plus so your bracket open bracket close this is my for loop and inside this for loop i'll write i will compare if r of j if r of j greater than sl is it clear here i'll write right if r of j greater than what sl and and fl not equal to r of j fl not equal to r of j then i want to assign the r of j value to sl sl is equal to r of j this is a simple logic you have to write actual okay now i want to find the second largest number so after this for loop i'll try to print the second largest system dot out dot print ln system dot out dot print ln of fl first largest number i want to print and second largest number first largest number is plus fl and here second largest number is sl this is second largest number is sl okay na? now just let us see here save it once you compile let us check whether it is working or not java c largest demo dot java execute the program first largest number is seven second largest number is six let us see how it is working okay now i will explain you so these are the values okay fine three four one five seven six these are my values that are available in the array how many values one two three four five six values are there in array each and every value can be identified by using index number zero one two three four five and the name given for the array is are very fine now after executing this for loop again i previously i already executed fl is how much seven fl is how much seven fine so first largest is seven now coming to sl sl is how much initially error of zero that is three now again you execute this for loop so error of zero is three three greater than here you see three greater than three and three greater than three and mm, fl is what seven seven not equal to three see here see the condition end operator will return true if both the conditions are true three greater than three is what false seven not equal to three true false true is what seven not equal to three yes false true is false now coming to the second the loop will return second time means three we checked now check with four now here of j is what four four greater than three okay na? and uh, seven not equal to four let us see here four greater than three true seven not equal to four true now come inside sl is how much four yes now coming to the loop will at third time so one no. so here what to do uh, year of j is what one one greater than what four and seven not equal to what for you have to substitute the values then you'll get some clarity one greater than four false seven not equal to four true false true is false next value is five now let us see five greater than four and seven not equal to five so let us five greater than four true 7 not equal to 5 true so what is the second largest number is 5 first largest number is 7 fine now come into the next value important now here here of j is what 7 7 greater than what 5 and 7 not equal to what 7 yes 7 greater than 5 true 7 not equal to 7 false 7 is equal to 7 so true false is false so don't modify this sl this is what important logic here okay now so first largest is seven second largest is five now come to here 
now here what is the value six six greater than five and six not equal to what um five yes or no so six greater than five true six not equal to five true so second largest is six first largest is seven here only companies will decide your logical skills based on these programs only very very important programs these all are write a program to find the first largest number and second largest number in the given array did you understood program to find the first largest number and second largest number in the given array did you understood and sometimes if interviewer will ask write a program to find the sum of the first largest number and second largest number so it is very simple system dot out dot pindle enough here you can write uh, sum is sum is simply you can print sum is here you can print plus here you can print fl plus sl first largest plus second largest save it open the command prompt here you can write compile and then execute sum is 13 okay like that you can try the programs is it clear program to swap the minimum value and maximum value in the given array that is also you can try program to swap the minimum value and maximum value in the given array you try that one 